Hey, what's up, guys? It's Crazy1976 bringing you a little Halo 4 action, playing a little Team SWAT here. That's not what we're here for. I actually have a little bit of news for you, along with this really killer gameplay. Is of course uh, TEC, as if you haven't heard, is expanding to the North American continent, and we need your help. That means we need gamers, we need players, we need streamers, we need supporters, we need it all. So of course. Uh, you're interested in uh, joining and supporting and helping out TEC and of course branch out to this uh, new frontier for for the European community branch into the NA of course uh, get a hold of me I will throw my Twitter link in the description also there's also uh, smiting fatty he is going to be helping me out as much as he can he's going to be casting and all that good stuff so uh, yeah get with him as well and make sure his link is in the description because we need your help uh, we can't do this alone, and uh, TEC has such a great potential here in this side of the pond that uh, personally I'm really excited for it, and I can't wait for uh, for big things to come. So uh, check that out, and of course uh, follow us. You know, keep watching these videos. Come hang out at the streams. We do have, of course, TEC TV on Twitch TV, and the recent launch of the TEC Community Channel. This is where all the shenanigans will go down as far as like the fun stuff and you name it it'll be the community channel for uh, for the community as a whole both North America and EU and that stream will be very very active in the very near future we plan on launching the NA side of the stream probably here in a couple of weeks being towards the end of December want to get up and running before of course the big holiday being Christmas but that is it we need your help and uh, we can't do it alone there is a couple of more announcements that, that I would like to make, but I, I can't. We have a, a returning member coming back into the fray as kind of a part-time, a little bit more of a consultant. I can't say who, but uh, I will wait for that announcement to get posted uh, by the uh, people with uh, a little bit more power than me. <laughs> Anyways, so keep an eye out for the stream, and of course, uh, support TEC's... Uh, community efforts because uh, we want to expand we want to get bigger of course it will be a competitive based here on the a NA side meaning um, you know if we will be playing all our lobbies by esports rules and things of that nature for Call of Duty Ghost we'll probably get some Halo we may even have a little bit of uh, shenanigans going on with some Grand Theft Auto 5 you name it um, of course this is uh, you know you play your games your way so uh, that's what it's going to be all about here on the NA side and if you are part of the European community and you still want to help out, of course, um, you know, you're going to have to follow the TEC's uh, Twitter and uh, go check out some of the links that have been posted because, guess what? Um, there's all kinds of documents you need to fill out if you want to be a streamer or a caster and things like that. And, you know, we want to make sure we get the best of the best, and uh, that's just the way it is. So uh, head over to the TEC Twitter channel and find those links so that way uh, you can get involved and if you know if you just want to come hang out and a stream and uh, hang out and watch and, play and maybe even play with some of us even better we'll, we'll take all the help we can get and uh, I was actually just given permission to make an announcement uh, because it was made public Vincent EU is now back in the fold here at Totally Sports Circuit welcome back Vincent and uh, looking forward to ha seeing what you have in store for us uh, Definitely going to be helping out with the marketing aspect of things, and uh, of course, with your expertise in esports, uh, it's, it's a much welcome uh, addition to to the team. And uh, since you're a former team member of of TEC, then uh, you, you know what it's all about. And uh, welcome back, and glad to have you. But here on board this team spot, and just kind of just headshot and headshot and fools. And here in a couple minutes, I get a really good kill. Ran out of bullets, should have gotten a triple, but I didn't quite get it. But did get the triple ki or get the killing spree out of it. I think that's my second one in this map. Oh, I missed him. But anyway, yeah, we got Benson back. We're expanding to the e, uh, to the NA, being North America. And if you look around here real closely, I haven't decided where I'm going to put it. I think I'm going to put it down in the uh, lower left there. Oops, forgot to turn off my, my notifications when I recorded this. But uh, I think I'm going to put it down in the lower left there. Uh, 
A little 3D animation of a TEC logo to uh, support both NA and European. And, uh, you know, give me your thoughts on that. What could be done to improve that logo for streaming and things like that? Because I really like it, but there's always room for improvement. Nice kill. Jump and kill. Got the killing frenzy. Keeping that ki keeping that streak going. That was the kill I was telling you guys about. I was actually quite proud of that one. Seven, eight kills in a row, and then get that jump kill. Bang. Done. Trying to make my way around to the team's flank, and, uh, of course, uh, I think my team is doing a really good job of keeping them out of the spawns because uh, these guys are just getting just getting beat up by everybody right now, including myself. And, if you, you know, if you guys haven't had a chance to try out Halo 4, um, if you're a Halo fan, I think I uh, went for the triple kill, didn't quite pull it off, just... Bad shooting, bad aim on my part. No, but if you haven't had a chance to buy Halo or you know try out Halo 4, I highly recommend you do. If you're a Halo fan, um, this really feels like Halo. Um, it is it is not the travesty that Reach was. It is uh, kind of harkens back to the glory days of what of what Halo was, with some additions and of course the graphical upgrade is nice. Um, I'm personally excited for Halo 5 on next gen, being the Xbox One can't wait to see what that thing looks like because uh, if they were able to make the graphics look this good on old gen I can't wait to see what 343 does on the new gen and of course um, while you're over there on Twitter guys I hate to change subjects but while you're over there on Twitter head over to Hapog HQ give them a follow um, I've been using the Hapog for quite some time now and they've been a huge supporter of TEC from day one and we'd like to keep that going uh, this is actually brought to you by Hapog so make sure that you give them a follow thanks for watching guys and we will check you guys out later.